Cause I'm about that We check in. Right. Four minutes, baby. Never give up. Keep them rolling. From Newcomers Town, Ohio. I got married just a few weeks ago. Let's hear it for Hunter Shryock. Happy to report. Been together three weeks, still together. Still together. Five fish today for 12 pounds even. Moves into sixth place currently. 12 pounds even and uh, decent start to the tournament. You know, it, it, gonna have a lot of guys, I think, Group in that 12 to 13 is going to be a game of ounces when it comes to the cut. Yeah, it is. And, uh, man, I, coming into this week, I really was hoping that the sun would shine. And, and it did. It just got really cold and a lot of stuff going on in this fishery. It's, it's got me a little bit spun out after today. But good thing is I'm going to go out and fish uh, clean tomorrow, fresh-minded. Um, I mean, I caught my big, biggest fish with four minutes left to go doing something completely different. So it's like just go through the general round. Be dumb. We can do it. You can do it. I can do it. I know you can. I'm looking forward to seeing it work out. Is there more or less pressure now now that you, you are a husband? <laughs> I don't think there's more pressure. I think there's less less pressure. We're a team now. Oh, that's so nice. I, We're a team now, right? Wow. So, so things get a little bit easier. The, it, it is easier coming to the tournaments and everything. And I couldn't do it without her supporting me all the time. And I uh, can't, can't do it without you guys being here either. So thanks for coming out. Be sure to come back tomorrow. We just wrapped up day one. It was a very uneventful day. Not, uh, I, I kind of sensed what could have happened. What I'm doing isn't the deal deal. That's not the way to go about this tournament. Um, but the good thing is we got tomorrow. It's going to be totally different conditions. We got rain, uh, wind, um, all day. So, and, and honestly, the sight fishing kind of evaporated. Not, it's still to be done, 
but it's like I said, there's not a lot of big fish to be caught. So you're spent more time looking and you know going behind guys and everything else. So literally with seven minutes left to fish I pull in right before check-in just like everybody out here we all stop and fish that last couple minutes and I pulled up this dock pitched my general out there caught a three and a half pound spot got it called the other one out and checked in with I think I was calling with four minutes left to go so fish all the way up to the last minute that fish really saved the day because if without it I would have had ten and a half pounds. So yeah, we're gonna go run new stuff tomorrow. Just go fishing off the seat of our pants and you know I'm gonna have to catch 14 to 15 pounds to get into the, the check the check line uh, top 35 and hopefully get something figured out to go fishing on Saturday. So that's the plan. Yesterday, five fish to add to that today. Looking for 13.11 for the cut. 9.1, unfortunately, short of the cut here this week in 57th place with 21.1. And uh, like we talked yesterday, he's a brand new newlywed. And the nice thing is, if you get a honeymoon weekend, I guess. Yeah, we, well, we already had a, the classic. I, I didn't get to fish the classic either, so that was, we had our honeymoon at the classic. Just kidding. We're saving that till the end of the year, but. Uh, this place is an awesome place, and I feel like I kind of beat myself this week. I love sight fishing, and these fish are pulling up, and I just kind of got sucked into the wrong area of the lake. But you know what? If, you, if to everybody that uh, you know asked a lot of, you know, I get a lot of questions about fishing. Uh, what what should we do? Well, or what what should you do? Go fish your strengths. I went and fished my strengths this week. I bombed. I didn't have a great tournament, but. When, when you see the best and the best doing what they do, they're always fishing their strengths. So trust your gut, go fish your strengths, and if it's in, uh, in the cards for you, it's gonna work. Always great to have you here, Hunter. We'll see you at Winyon Bay.
literally, I have dreams about events like this. And to just miss the deal, miss the region of the lake, just completely. I was out there selling hot dogs at the hot dog stand instead of being in the ballpark. But <laughs> we're gonna go over to the Bass Live thing. And we gotta pack our stuff up to get ready for Winya Bay, which is practice starts on Monday. So valuable lesson. Again, learn, mark it off. Paid for in full, and off to the next one. Stop number four. We need another solid event, though. Get um, Angler of the Year points back on track. It's probably a bad thing that I'm thinking about Angler of the Year points, but I am. We're going to go um, get this stuff done, wrap this up, travel to Georgetown. Let's do it. All right, we got Robbie Kilroy from Georgia. Everybody welcome up. Had a solid bag yesterday. Wave to the crowd. Bring your, bring your fish up here. Bring them up here. Put them up here. Come on. Put them up there. All right. He needs, he needs 14 pounds and eight ounces to win. Let me be trip. Wait, I gotta be bald. Okay. 14 pounds and eight ounces. Boom! 17 pounds and eight ounces! That. Cheer really loud for him one Show more time. Show us your purse. Hold your trophy up. Hold your trophy up. Everybody out there telling you if you want to do this, it's, I started out in 2012. It was like a far, far cry from being a professional angler. And someone like this has got a great future. We got the bass programs, the high school program, programs, college programs. And you're going to see guys just like this up here in a couple years, right? Walk right up front. Yeah, hold it high. That's what it's all about, everybody. It, this is the future of the sport, so we really support it, and that's going to be it's going to be awesome. So if you want to be up here, work hard, and we appreciate you, man. Thank you for coming up here. We'll see you up here in about ten years, okay? All right, Robbie Kilroy from Georgia, everybody. Thank you.